Hey y'all, welcome back. Today, we're in my little workshop at the house. Got this little axial crawler here. Y'all may recognize it from our video when we went to Taylor Hollow. At that time, we were actually just borrowing it from a friend of mine. Well, he reached out to me, said he kind of wanted a different model um, and offered to sell us this one. So we went ahead and scooped that up, started doing a little bit of research on it. Um, already got different tires, wheels, and a few other components in mind actually working on getting a toyota body because my ultimate goal is going to be to make a 124th scale version of a farm truck um, it may not look identical because you're taking something that is real and scaling it down um, but we're going to try i mean i think it'd be kind of cool to do and uh, i've been eyeballing these things for a while and I figure when my son gets a little bit older, we might pick one up for him and we can just go out and have fun together. So let's take a look at it. So here it is, the Axial 124 scale C10. Ready to run right out of the box. I feel this thing's actually pretty capable right out of the box. Um, of course, like anything, you can upgrade it and make it a little bit better. We've played with it on the gravel pile at work as well as a little bit in my ditch where I have some pavers to make a drainage area and then some rock outcropping then of course you've seen it in our video at Taylor Holler climbing up through some muddy areas stuff like that so let's take a little closer look at it in order to open this thing up you've got two hood pins up front which i've already pulled basically just camera focused little cotter pins body lifts right up put your motor down here underneath battery tray on top esc and your steering all of which are upgradable whenever you start to go to heavier components like brass steering brass linkage, um, aluminum or brass wheels, bigger wheels and tires, because eventually that's gonna wear out that stock component because all of that is plastic. Um, so yeah, that's basically it to these little things. Can't wait to dive into it. So with all that said, I hope y'all like the new addition to the channel. Hope it adds a different little bit of element of creativity, hobby, fun, and I hope y'all follow along. This could be a fun build.